So this is the same patient that presented to our institution a few months later in regards to their presumed mucosal. Remember too that mucoceles can range from the benign mucinous cyst adenoma to malignant variety, which is the cyst adenocarcinoma with any kind of level in between, including LAM, which is a low-grade appendiceal mucinous tumor. So same patient, you know, recognize this mucosal, you see that calcification in the center of it and some in the walls right here, but something happened in the interim. So we scroll through it, it looks pretty much similarly dilated. There's not really any inflammation around it. We don't have an acute appendicitis component of this, but you do now have this almost loculated fluid anterior to it. And if you're looking closely at the wall, we've lost the wall right here. So in between those several months of when that patient presented to the outside institution and then came to our institution for surgery and for purposes of planning their surgery, this mucosal ruptured. You have loss of integrity of the wall right here. You can also tell this isn't an abscess. This is the mucosal itself by Hounsfield units. It's virtually identical if you put them on. There's no enhancing wall, however. This does look loculated. It's not like free fluid that should flow into the pelvis. As you can see here, there really is no free fluid layering in the pelvis. And that's because this isn't free fluid. This is mucus. So it's going to kind of sit where it ruptured from, but it's not an abscess. There's no thick wall. There's nothing enhancing right here. So it's kind of this in-between sort of appearance. And in this case, the mucus still ruptured, which is very important for the surgeon to know because it goes from a simple appendectomy, partial colectomy, take this out, this hasn't spread anywhere, to this has clearly spread into the peritoneum. And now you might have to consider further therapies such as beyond just cytoreductive therapy where you get out all of the deposits that you can, but you might need HIPEC, which is hypothermic intraperitoneal chemotherapy. This is still a little bit tricky and controversial, this therapy itself, but at our institution, it's pretty, pretty standard for what we'll do in cases like this. So this person did end up going to get their mucosal taken out and it had ruptured as you know, it was very clear on the CAT scan itself. And they did end up getting HIPEC and this ended up being a low-grade appendiceal mucinous neoplasm. But as you can tell, given that this is here, this kind of gelatinous mucinous material, it's going to be much trickier, longer surgery with possible recurrence simply because you cannot clear out all of that very easily in a surgery, whereas you can just take the appendix out if it hasn't ruptured yet.